What a new YouTube is a boy damn man. We back in the truck. We cooking up another banger man today. I guess we got a prank going wrong. You know them people that just be doing wild stuff. Y'all remember boot game in the past? He was stealing, going in Popeyes, going over the counter, eating chicken. I guess this man right here is going around. Well, the black dude, he going around stealing luggages, allegedly for pranks. And it didn't end up going his way. So we're gonna see how this goes, bro. Cause like people taking content creating to streams, bro. Everybody ain't soft. Everybody ain't sweet on just let you run run up on them and take something. Hold on. I think it's on mute. Alright, there we go. Camera. Bro, chill out. What? Come on, man. You try to steal the nigga luggage. He ain't overreacting. He think you trying to take his stuff. You trying to steal from this man. Oh, he he is a prank. It's a joke. Man, that man drilling and running. He don't care about no joke. No prank. You literally try to run up. That man might have his his laptop in there with million dollar ideas in there. Kids stuff. Sure. Oh, memories. You trying to run off with that nigga suitcase. Oh, he he hi, it's a prank. I'm sorry, my bad. Nah, my drilling and rushing it. Nah, man, you finna get you finna get this melee. But he can he can let go, go though. Let go of my hair. You're getting somebody to go. You're getting somebody to go. I'm not gonna fight you. You you assaulted me. Next one's you know you assaulted over at home. Check this man's camera, please. Yeah. Don't touch me. Don't touch me, buddy. Don't touch me. I didn't touch you. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Hey, he don't want bro. Hey, you what what Charles said? Why you say? He said, if I ever get knocked out, I'm gonna shoot the nigga with the camera. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't funny, but at the end of the day, what is it? It's called like law of attraction, bro. That's what I think. It's like what what is it called? Murphy's law. Like you do something messed up. Come on, something messed up gonna happen back to you, bro. Come on. It ain't no yeah, it's a prank, man. You do something, something back gonna happen. It's got a reaction, bro. Just like this channel. Don't, don't, touch, bro. don't touch me. Don't touch me, sir. <laughs> he forced him. <laughs> My man woke up on This kind of My man woke up on the wrong side of the bed, bro. But he's sitting there and did that little prank, though. He's going to be all messed up. As you see a young black man there getting snatched around by his head and pulled on the ground and stuff, uh, of course, instantly pissed me off. Um, but what happened was that YouTuber, uh, his name is Canel Joseph, and he's pulling a prank, a luggage prank at the airport. Airport probably around the time when people are losing luggage, right. uh, missing flights, right. all that type of stuff is happening in a very stressful situation. Right, that man, my head got delayed. He was late for his plane. He trying to find his terminal. He only got two minutes to hop on the plane. He you over here playing with this man. That man, wife could have like, cheated on him. His kids don't like him. Nigga could have lost his job. You don't know what this man was going through. And you pulled that prank and it just it's, it just set him off. He snapped. That's why y'all just can't be talking to man, y'all talk. Y'all know. We ain't even gonna talk about y'all teasing kids in the schools and wonder why they come hit that bitch up. Everything you do, it's like it's a reaction to it, bro. You can't just go. I don't know. I know it, it's a lot of YouTubers that do it. Like it's it's people that go to your ear and moan in your ear. Like, well, for, what funny funny Marco do? Like going people's grocery cores and take. Hey, like, people be taking this content creating stuff to the max. Like, but it's funny then. I mean, I don't know. So he sides the luggage crazy. prank. Prank might be what's happening. I guess the luggage prank was taking someone's luggage and acting like it's yours and saying I didn't know because that's how pranks work. That's funny, but still, it's real life. A man got snatched around by his head and up on his knee, and that really bugged me. Let's watch him explain what happened, though. 
What is up everybody that's watching right now? So basically your boy just got manhandled. We messed with the wrong person. He actually ended up being like a serial killer. So Ooh. we actually got him arrested, so. What the hell? This nigga was a... Oh, what? Oh. This man was a serial killer? Oh, no, 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 no. You think he capping? So what you did, you got this man was trying to stay from the laws probably, man. He wasn't trying to be hot. You got this nigga hot. Damn. You would never know nowadays, bro. The man that whooped him up was a serial killer. Hey, you know now. Hey, nowadays, bro, you never know. Y'all stay safe out here. No, I'm just kidding. He was just a regular uh -huh. old angry white. Stop playing with me, bro. That made me think he was actually serial killer. I was going to feel sorry for you. Hey, man. Basically, what happened was he was just attacking me and my filmer, and the police showed up. And he ended up still trying to attack my, you know, my cameraman, Aaron. Aaron, how did you feel about it? Dude, it was ass, dude. He really tried coming for me, but he was not going to get me. See, so basically it did not end well, and the cops ended up tackling him. And then the cops asked us, like, hey, do we want to press charges and stuff like that? And we're like, nah. You know, we're not one of those people. We're messing with him. We're not going to, like, ruin Yeah, you was messing with him, bro. You got to take, take that on the chin, bro. Y'all niggas knew what was going to come, what, what was going to happen, bro. What you think will happen if we go steal these guys, prank and see if they might get mad? Uh, duh. Either somebody going to let you take their stuff, somebody going to call the police on you, somebody going to whoop you, or somebody going to react like this. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me see. The five stages of somebody trying to steal a package slash prank. Somebody might let you steal it because they, they just ain't, they don't want to stick up for themselves. Somebody gonna yell at you like, what the hell are you doing, bro? You tripping, come get that stuff back. The other person gonna whoop on you. Like crazy. Other people might call the police or airport security. And somebody might, might pop your ass, bro. You never know. In his life, even though, you know, he was yanking your boy, smacking your boy, pulling him like he was a dog. So, you know, your boy's been in the hospital, you know, recovering from that hair tug. You know, my oh head my was on fire. So I'm back now and a little better. And I just, I'm not gonna lie, I just need you guys help to comment down below and just say prayers for Canel. On the bright side, as long as you guys know my pranks aren't fake, I'm not tripping. So, so that's the focus here. As long as you guys know my pranks started fake, people might jump around and snatch me by the head. It seems like he's maybe not as bothered by the hair yanking as I was. Or maybe he was. We ain't got time to that nigga talk, but um, no disrespect, my boy. Um, but I don't see nothing wrong. I feel like that I said I no disrespect, my dude. I feel like you should have went to jail too. You didn't got this nigga in the jail, see. Why did why did you feel that way? Because, man, he don't know what this man was going through that day, bro. That man could have had, like, the worst day ever, bro. He was like, bro, I can almost make it home without going off, without getting ticked off. And you push that one button. Like, he was about to snap already, but he, he woo side himself. But you decided to put a prank on him, and he snapped. Or he just might have been a deuce bag, but at the end of the day, he don't deserve to get tugged like that. But it's a, like I say, it's, everything you do is a reaction to it, bro. So I just feel like, stop playing with people out here. Y'all reactors, I know it's content, this was getting y'all money and all that, but it's other stuff to do on YouTube, bro, that would get you a bag. Harassing people, it's, it's gonna get somebody hurt. But look, what we need you to do for this video is click that like button, comment down below any video you want me to show you had to. Three most important subscribe to the family that we work. Join that Discord, join that Patreon, hit the Instagram up, follow that. Follow my Facebook page for there to do the reacts to. I post on there. If some of y'all don't got YouTube and y'all got Facebook or your mama don't got YouTube on her phone, or you got YouTube on your TV, I know you got Facebook. So I got a Facebook page you can follow and watch my videos on there too, because what I do, I share it on there. Boom, boom, boom. My videos is everywhere. I try to post them on Twitter, YouTube. Rumble, they everywhere. But look, follow that content, man. I'm going to get you out some more work, man. Appreciate y'all.